I feel like I need to say no homo to that shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck it, oh, bro. Audio listeners are in for a treat. <laughs> you might as well put your mic near you. know the, What's that? AMS? MS. <laughs> <laughs> I see people that's, that's probably that's five, ten people. years older than us, and they're fucking crying. I'm like, I'll cry for LeBron, but shit, nigga, I watched this oh, nigga LeBron. do greatness. I'm sorry, yeah, I was, I, was, I wanted to say the last few days. Yeah. Kobe's death hit me more than Kobe does. A hundred, hundred, hundred. Of of course, that's what I'm saying. Like, you see these other people, we got to see them do something, and and that's no disrespect. But I'm just saying, like, I don't understand that attachment because what did you watch her do, like? Oh, yeah. No, but what did you? What did they watch her do? I don't understand. Huh? Good speech on Christmas Day, bro. Like you know, what I'm saying what they have nothing yeah. intangible. You're saying, they you got to say he's being serious, bro. No, he ain't. Come on, man. But people love the Queen, you know. I know. I know. I understand people love her, but I'm just like when I try and no, be out of it, I'm like. <laughs> I see that video and <laughs> she she had a down for the G. I do actually think she looks like she was a very nice woman. I ain't gonna lie. Of course, I could be wrong. Normally the nice ones, I'd be doing the more fucked up shits behind closed like doors. Ones, but she did seem like a real one. Bro, bro, nah, nah, keep the same energy you've been having. Yeah, Zam, brother. I'm not here for it. Bro, talk the shit you've been talking about her, bro. Not, she seemed like a nice woman. <laughs> nah, I didn't say that, I said real one. Uh, bro, I said we pour some Henny up for her. That's what we need to do. Some hand dog, some bro. Respect. We're right in it. Welcome back, Renaissance Man Podcast. Um, well, Renaissance Man Production. This is the podcast episode. You don't even know. Um, <laughs> listen, <laughs> I, that's what I'm saying. I was like, shit, nigga, I know too. Um, we'll talk about the Queen in it. So, first thoughts. Has anyone got something nice to say? AJ, you don't really have something nice to say. Um, our dear beloved. Um, you know what? I asked my mum and dad today, ain't it? Mm-hmm. I was testing the waters. I said, are you, sa- are you sad the queen died? And my mum said something that I think I agree with. She was like, nah, I'm not sad that she died. Mm-hmm. But she was like, it's always sad when someone dies. So she was like, yeah, like in a humanitarian way, yeah. But in a, am I affected by it? Nah, like. That's facts. Like, and even me and Josh were talking about it. Like, I'm going to think about her as much as she thought about me. Yeah. Which I'm guessing is not a fucking lot, if any at all. <laughs> so like, like yeah, sad someone's died, but am I affected by it? Uh, probably not. No, but lovely woman from what I've from what I see, what I see, like, mate. A lot of people don't agree with like the monarchy, but herself, I ain't got a problem with her. But mm. I'm not gonna. Sorry, carry on speaking. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't losing sleep over that one. I don't know. I don't know what you guys think, Sam. I agree, man. <coughs> sad she died. Like sad, like <laughs> someone died. Like that's someone, like someone's mum, someone's <laughs> nan. In that sense, is sad. But like, see, to me, yeah, we know what. You know, what I'll compare it to. You know, when someone goes, um, like I was having a conversation with someone like a couple of weeks ago. And we'll, I think we'll talk about how bad it maybe is, like, um, being the police. And they were saying, like, yeah, man, like, people are actually doing stuff to the police these days. I think it was in America, so actually. And I was like, yeah, I hear you, but, like, there might be police, but that's just a job title. They're just like every other human. You know what I'm saying? Just because a police officer gets killed does not mean, like, we have to be in an uproar. Like, it's another human. Obviously, you should be sad that someone's being killed, but their role does not make them above a normal person. Mm. That's why I was like, of course, yeah, just like your mum said, someone died, that's not always good. So, like, I repeat to her. You know I mean? Okay, that's true. But their duty is bigger than most average humans. Do you know what I mean? They, they will actually put their lives in. I know they've signed up for mm-hmm. the job, but regardless of the fact. Yeah, no, I, I get you. But, like, I think your duty being higher than everyone else, like, it should hopefully be paid for, like, 
more than everyone else or at least even if it's not money wise it's like you probably afforded some things that other people aren't afforded because of what your job is but other people still have the say still worry about the same things you worry about kids wife you know what i mean so to me in that sense it's just like it's equal like i've never understood like i mean i get it i get we're humans but you know what like a policeman does it's like every single police officer is just riding and it's like manhunt for whoever did it and it's like that's like bro. that's like i kind of get that though no, i mean because I'm it's like it's kind of like you got to protect your own kind of thing it's like if one of you man died i'm gonna be like raw like but I, yeah go on because it's like you're you're so close but so far at the same time do you know what i mean especially with something like that if you're a police officer like the example we're using and another police officer dies let's say doing his job that could have been you do you know what i mean at least that's mm. how i'm guessing how they perceive it yeah 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 and i get how they perceive it that way why you would but like i'm like you should feel that way about every other per- like anyone dying you know what i mean and it's like yeah i just feel like you should feel that about no matter who it is that dies and that aspect of what you're saying i think that's what kind of makes it come across or feel like they are like a gang in some way you know what i'm saying yeah 100 percent. yeah you know what i mean because it's like i think there's certain things you do in life that once you sign that paper you are above feeling like your need for revenge like the normal human you're a police officer now bro like you should of course not easy but you should detach certain things like if a police officer gets murdered like yeah you feel it because that's part of you like you might know him but like you need to feel that whoever dies there's someone who feels that way and you being a police officer first thing you say is like i know you feel this way calvin but no you cannot fucking pick up a gun and go do this yourself mm. so you gotta ca- you gotta be the example you're trying to enforce i think you know what i mean mm. but i get it. i get it in the human aspect of it yeah again. i was about to say then again i'm not i agree with everything you're saying i'm just playing devil's advocate but then again it's like you're human before you're a police officer yeah no i do get that but that's why i think there should be a clear like Yo, bro, when you sign this paper, mm. you give up certain things and it'll feel in certain ways, at least when you're in this uniform. Because, yeah, otherwise it's just a gang. It's just like, you know what I mean? I don't know. Gang with badges. Yeah, bro. And that's why people say, like, the police is the biggest gang. Because the same thing. They ride for each other. They protect each other no matter what fuck shit they're all doing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that mentality carries over. It doesn't, get, it doesn't just stay on, like, oh, Calvin died, so we're going to ride for him. It also carries over to the bad things they do as well. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I'm like... But yeah, anyway, rest in peace to the Queen. Um, you know, I was thinking, my first thought was, does this change anything in regards to, like, the countries that had rule over? No. Or does it no. just carry on to the next person? It'll, like? ca- it'll carry on. But I'm say- I was, was I saying it to you, Sam, in the car, like... Or I might have been saying it to someone else. It will, I f- like, you know, you tweeted, like, it could change a lot. It, it, yeah, actually, I feel like we're could, somehow. it actually could somehow. change a lot because the that queen was the only head of state a lot of people have ever known, a lot of countries have ever known, mm. the whole of the Commonwealth has ever known. She had known. clout, bro. Yeah. She had clout. So, yeah. See yeah. a new guy come in and you just think, no, I don't, I don't fuck with you the way I fucked with her. Like, listen, Charles, Charlie. See, <laughs> your thing, it don't carry weight like Lizzie. That's, that's what I'm saying. That's why I was asking that question. Like, obviously, it should just carry on. But yeah, certain people are going to feel like they had a certain loyalty towards the Queen. Yeah. The Queen yeah. is a breath like. Well, king and don't sound right, man. It doesn't like, sound got right. the King of England. Uh, ki- king, which king. is weird. It doesn't sound right because that's normally how it goes. Yeah. No, I think it, do- it does. It does. It does. But we're just used to the, yeah, we're just used to a Queen. Yeah, yeah, I get what you mean. Yeah, in England, just feels like king because it's always just yeah. been. Think of every movie you watch since you've been alive. It's just, it's you know just I mean? our life. It's Queen, just like when I speak it about England, in yeah, yeah. Since yeah. we like were born, she is our. Regardless of the fact, she is our first. Queen. I was even saying to Josh, it got it. I never considered it. Not that I think about her every day, but I never thought she'd die. Yeah, mm. mate. When I was, I yeah, was at work true. when it happened. Yeah, and. So, like, obviously, the news broke during the day that she's not feeling well. Mate, some people, and we'll get into that in a minute, but um, 
so news broke that she weren't feeling well and the family had like all flown to like wherever she was. Bro, one woman come out of the in my work and was like, She's died. My mum's just called me and said that she's died out and I had like bro, I just didn't believe I was like, nah, she ain't dead. Like didn't believe it Mate. Bro, that she could actually just be gone. Like she can actually die, but she's actually all Bro, like, it wasn't too long ago she was in that's what she was say. in the range. Bro. Just whipping. She'd be whipping her thing, boy. That's what I mean. Even though she's old, isn't it? She was 96, but she always looked healthy. Oh, yeah. Healthy, bro. I don't think it was long ago when we talk about, like, I think it was Raheem was here saying, like, and I think he was making a joke, like, how they just, their blood is just different, isn't it? Like, you know what I'm saying? So they never, they can, that's why they live to so old. Bro. Because we talk about, um, who's Philip. the one that's always in fucking hospital? He d- he Philip. actually oh, dead he now, though, isn't it? Philip. Yeah. 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 Husband, yeah, yeah. But bro, even, even he, her mum lived to 101. Oh, is that the husband? Bro. That, that was her yeah, husband. The yeah. one that looked like he'd already been dead for 15 yeah. years. Yeah, vampire. He had, a, like, he had a, what was it, a heart operation, like February, March, and then obviously just You know what? Yeah, that's mad you man say this. There's this thing, you don't might know, and AJ, you might, you read in it like a lot, where it's like, they say like a lot of relationships, a lot of couples, what you find, if yeah. one part, one person dies, the partner normally dies like yeah, a year yeah. later. Yeah. And it's more than just about health. It's like some spiritual yeah. type Heartbreak, of, bro. you know what I mean? Like, and it's fucked. I like, I know it's something, I'm, I know I can't say I don't believe in it. I can't say I don't believe in it because it's true. Yeah. But I believe in it like, do you guys get what I said? I'm yeah. kind of going in roundabouts, but I believe in that, mm-hmm. even though it's already true. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. same. I know you. But I only feel like it only applies to elderly couples that have been yeah. together. Not like you yeah. won't hear that from like I haven't heard that from that young people. Like I've years. heard like thirty plus years marriage. Then yeah, I think that's like the yeah. Where it happens a lot, yeah. Not a cut off of where it starts. That is mad though. Like, yeah, I wonder what that is. Apparently, she died on Sunday. Yeah, apparently, I had one of the drivers like just uh, (laughs) goes to work for Burby. Sunday. Yeah, apparently she died on Sunday, but they had to get everyone together. Right. To like reveal There it. is like conspiracy theories about it that she died, she died way like, before they announced it. it. Yeah. yeah. Really? She was, already, she was already dead. Yeah. Which I found weird because Apparently. I didn't know nothing about her being like ill or anything until the day she died. No, no, they, they did. She, yeah, she was ill. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's why the Prime Minister, she had to go to Scotland to meet her. Mm. Or so they say oh, now. Yeah, right. yeah. Actually, now she did because of the picture. She had to go to Scotland to meet her. Um, and that was the first time it's ever happened. Mm. Normally she goes to them and it like whatever number ten or something, but she had to go to her. No, but apparently the the girl the driver I had she she was like yeah apparently like the Spanish media and like I think she said Italian but mm-hmm. they like they already knew she was she was gone already like before ah. but that was before like the news broke out here on mm. was it what day was it yesterday yesterday, yesterday. Yeah, yeah before it broke out yesterday well yesterday Thursday mate you see that person's tweet. Oh. That's tweeted the Queen's gonna die on the was it is it yesterday the eighth? Ah oh, yeah. man, I see that, but I don't, them people just be tweeting a million and one things, and when one of them <laughs> hits, they just delete the rest, bro. They ain't, they ain't slick, boy. Well, someone said that she's gonna die on the eighth of September, and then Charles is gonna die on like March something twenty twenty six. So cool. So if he dies in March twenty twenty six, yeah. He's not. He's not Purge got much. Thing. Yeah, he's not got much left. Bro, bro, he just pass it down to William, man. But that's what I'm saying. Like, why even change your note, bro? Like, Hello? man's waited seventy years, bro. Yeah. it's time to shine. Yeah, man. listen. <laughs> if I get that thing um, now, I'm holding on to it for dear. No, you know what I didn't like. Yeah, uh, listen. I hope this is not to any disrespect to like the sad news, or whatever. But moving on, we are a podcast after all. How he was like, he came down today or whatever, and he, before he speaks, just shaking hands. I was like, fam, you're not celebrating, like, some type of kingdom you won through, like, a night ship fight, like. Brother, you see some, fam, vi- some man victories. Just, like, nah, tab, some my, victories he's got. That's your mum, like, you know? Like, nah, what? Nah, him, nah, not today, man. The 12 days of morning is coming, boy. If you're going to tell us to fucking... Do those top days, yeah. At least you can fucking do it or seem like you're fucking but, uh, morning. You know how many days he went up to bed picking, bro. I wish he had just kicked the bucket already, bro. <laughs> My oh, thing needs to change from prince to king, bro. I get it. I get it. Some fake king, man. What? 
Well, he don't feel like a king. He just feels like Donny that had to step in because she passed. Don't feel like he's the king. King Charles. Dead. Oh, That's normally how it fucking happens, bruv. Um, what was I about to say? And no one watching the king's speech. Christmas bruv, they Day, had really? it on every TV in the gym. Who the fuck's going to watch him, bruv? What, what, the queen on every TV? No, 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 the king's speech today. Did anyone actually watch it? Did I, yeah. I didn't watch it. It was like, it was on silent. Now, I could see the subtitles like a little bit. Um, I upset some old guy at work, by the way, about the Queen yesterday. Uh, we got into a little argument. Well, I was saying, like, we went into the break now, and like, he's an older, older man in it, like in his fifties. Mm-hmm. And I was like, "What? Well, she had a good like." Everyone was saying it, like, she had a good innings, bro. Ninety six, like, she had a long life. Fucking hell, she nearly got to the century, bro. bro yeah, yeah, bro. We're about to write herself a letter. But yeah, <laughs> um. Yeah, I said it like that. I didn't say it like rudely. I was like, oh, like, rest in peace and that. And he was like, oh, like, yeah, a bit of respect wouldn't go and miss. And I was like, well, I've said rest in peace. What do you want to do? Go to a funeral. She just said, brother, where were you when these men were saying nigger the other day? <laughs> bro, he was one of them, bro. Swear. Yeah. I'd have told his to shut the fuck up, bro. Oh, man. Fucking hell. But anyway, I was about to say, um, do you see how much my man gets now that the queen, because he takes over the fortune? 500 million, bruv. And the fucking rest. I said this 25 billion. (laughs) (laughs) What are you doing with this shit, yo? Like, oh, I'm sorry. What do you do as a king? Oh, mate. Me and Josh were having this conversation. Go to an island and. What do you. If you. you, If you. If if what. All of us say, one of us become king, you become king one day. Listen, I know we are a show that has gonna no look, white in us, like so North that's Korea. never gonna happen. But say so if it did, what, like, genuinely, what do you think you're doing? King. If I yeah. become king, I'm gonna do some shit. They're gonna have to, they're gonna snap me over, bro. Because, <laughs> fam, because I think, I don't know, I, I'd like to think, I think I'll do some, like, what's the word? Altruism shit. You know, like the good that doesn't benefit you. I might just send that shit to Africa somewhere, bro. You know what I mean? Send all the jewels back. Fam, imagine that. Imagine that. And fucking starvation. Everybody be trying to kill me, bro. Oh, bro. Josh said, Josh said he don't think it will be all this. Or you think it will be. No. Of course not. Of course bro, you not. You know, they like... Bro, they're, they're puppets. Have, I feel like they won't have... If you're king, you won't have control of everything. No, bro, no, no. Nothing, I don't think. Say, no. Bro, think you know the image. establishment runs everything, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, but um, listen, if you man become king, you're not worried about that sort oh, of okay, stuff. Okay, you're just yeah, saying, yeah. like, what the fuck like, are First you things doing? first, the party at Buckingham Palace. <laughs> oh, mate, brazy. Bro. Hey, <laughs> 12 day party. <laughs> <laughs> How many rooms be... that bitch got? <laughs> oh, bro. 102 rooms. <laughs> 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 I think it'd be kind of anticlimactic, though, you know? Well, you're king. king you mm. know? Brother, you're king. Do what you want. You could do whatever yeah, know, you but want. Like, just I'm right now, I'm asking you, like, Age is asking you right now, seriously, what are you doing if you could do what you want? Having a party. It's hard to think about. A party. That's what I'm saying. That's anticlimactic. I'm a king. Cool, I'm having a party. Oh, yeah, but he's having them parties mental. anyway. You know what I'm saying? Not like mine. You can't go on holiday, really. Like, I'll be trying to think, what can I really do that's just like, yo, I couldn't do this before today? You know what I'm saying? Cause anything else, he, he I'm sure he can do. Invite all the man them to Emirates and play. <laughs> <laughs> you could get away with murder. Oh, I'm telling you, literally, you can, literally, the last oh, sentence. Bro, yeah, literally. I'll probably just put our hits everywhere. They can't bro. go to prison, can they? Well, the Queen couldn't. Really? Yeah, she's like. To be fair, yeah. Who the fuck is putting her in? Yeah, like she yeah, just yeah. got back the gun out and just put a bullet in someone's head. She's not going to prison. Yeah, that obviously you makes don't need something. a passport. Don't clean that up. You don't need <laughs> <laughs> real <laughs> talk. <laughs> you don't need a passport. You don't need money. You, bro, what That's why she, now. Because they what don't she need, need a money, passport I'm for, like, bro. No, but like, I'm saying like, fucking leave the country. You don't need one. Yeah, my face is my passport. You better Google nah, me. Bro. You know bro, who I, got, I am. I've got 100 million Google. banknotes with my face on it. Bro. But they probably shut the whole airport down, fam. Uh... Uh, Elizabeth, can we have your Heathrow? Yeah, bro, it's got an airport in the back of the yard. Bro, Elizabeth, can we have your passport? Fifty pound note. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you keep it as well. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> dumb bitch. Fucking hell, bro. Rest oh, in babe. peace, man. Rest in peace. Yeah, rest in peace, man. She looked like a good woman. Do you know another question? I, I, 
uh, me and Joshua, we was asking each other random questions, as mm-hmm. you probably guessed. Yeah. Do you reckon she ever done like normal shit? Like, like when's the last time no. you reckon she like put a, put a wash on? Like me and Joshua, like, do you ever reckon she? Oh, like inside the crib and that? Yeah, like normal shit. Like put what? the washing machine on or like daily stuff. No, I don't. Like. Remember. Done washing up, like cleaned her plates. Like, when's the last time you actually done that? I think maybe, maybe that, when she was younger. Yeah, maybe now. Nah, maybe when she's with family. She strikes like, me as a type to like. She probably obviously I don't fucking know in it, but she looks like she's a type. To like, don't worry, I'm gonna get put the kettle on, do the TSR every night. You know what I mean, bro? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. She Just strikes make me a, a cup lot, of tea, bro. bro. She strikes me as she's like a proper woman, isn't down, it? Like she's like. Yeah, you know what I mean? Super down to earth. That's what I think. And like some of the stories you've heard, like even like Meghan Markle meeting her, sounds like she was like always the calm person the calm in the one, that's room. That's why I like her, bro. The one who's just going to be like, Yo, chill. Like, ain't no need to fucking, yeah. it's calm. That's what Harry said as well, isn't it? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like she, she was, was like just the, the one, bro. It was William the Listen, bro. Pussy, maybe she knew something. Maybe she's like, hey, yo, get the fuck out of this family right now before I'm gone, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Telling you, go now, go now. Cause they, they didn't even want you being the Prince of Wales and none. Cause them and the Prince of Wales and um their son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. William, well, and, William and Kate. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I don't know how that should work. Who's king next? Yeah, him, William. 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 Yeah. Then after yeah, really? that, because really? he's taken, <coughs> he's taken. Thing is, thing. Prince Charles or King Charles. Is <laughs> That's why I'm like, sorry to interrupt, but bro, there has to be certain thought there, yeah, for this man. What's his name? Ginger one. Harry to leave. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. The missus, bro. Because obviously his brother was gonna be first, but it still feels like it's so. Yeah, but he was close. never in line. Oh, was he? he no, nah, he's never in line. No, no. He. How, how does that work? He, it's. I don't know how it works, but he was never in the order. He's so like he's, sixth in the order. No, or he, apparently he's he's not in it at all. It always went Charles. Yeah, yeah. If it, William, because no, he's, he's not William, the first. He's got a kid now. Yeah, so it goes yeah. Down so it goes that down that, that bloodline. Then it would be George's fucking kid. Then it'd be their person. It doesn't go to Harry. Yeah, no, I know. I, uh, what you're saying is true, but I'm saying like, say if shit started, just people just started falling, dying. So like, he would be the sixth. So like, yeah, Charles yeah. would have to die. William would have to die. William's kid, uh, then yeah, him. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And then like, Andrew, the fucking kidly fiddler, he's like ninth. Like, Harry <laughs> then has to die. <laughs> someone else, then it's Andrew. So he got banished from that family, bro. Brother, he wasn't even allowed at the Jubilee. I don't know if he'll be at. No, the I actually feel sorry for the Queen because. All us, all our kids were just fuckeries. But of course, you know what I'm saying. You raising kids like she these men ain't had no more fucking lives. Yeah, for real. You know but you got to think, Andrew was at, out at fucking doing the private club thing in London, just <laughs> doing the mat. He was trying to live the normal life with all mm. the perks, bro. Yeah. Apparently, he's not allowed. Apparently, he's not going to be like with the sat with the family at the funeral. He can't be. That's fucked, he bro. Can, he, everyone knows what he was on. You can't. Oh wait, well, who? Andrew. Uh, the, the, Andrew. The, the no, Harry is. Harry. Was oh, there, I thought you meant Harry. Sorry, no, no, sorry. No, that's no, obviously Andrew. yeah. That's not fact. That's not fact. That is. Is right. Harry Harry not allowed to sit with the family? Nah. No, Harry is. Andrew oh. isn't. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course. He shouldn't be. Uh, Harry's I guess a grandkid, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Media was on him straight away, bro. Again, Say why? Because he was supposedly the last of the family to arrive, <laughs> and apparently the first to leave. Like after. And the media was just on him, bro. And people shit, just, bitch. None of these motherfuckers want to talk to me. People were just saying, like, me. he's just lost his grandma. Like, leave him the fuck alone. Like, uh, it was BBC yeah. News, innit? Like, breaking news. Fucking Harry, last to arrive, first and, to leave. And you know what he'll say? Bitch, I've been here for a week. My no, he's the closest to... Dumb. Apparently, he was the closest to the Queen. Yeah, but if we're saying she's died fucking Sunday, I'm sure, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's not how they're fucking painting mm. it. Like... Ding dong. Yeah, do you know you lot know how much um I looked into this today? I forgot because it obviously said like, "Oh, the new king is inheriting five hundred million the assets is twenty five billion." And do you know how much um because I I was like thinking, how the fuck does do these men get paid in it? And uh-huh. it was something like Saturn Grant, for what they call it. Do you know how much it is a year, bro? Like in twenty twenty one, over a hundred million. How do you reach? Taxpayer money. Money. Yeah, tax money. Yeah, taxpayer money. It's a, like 2021, it was like 116 million. Every year, her her pay comes from us. And it's that amount. No, I know that. 
I didn't know. I just I thought she don't pay for nothing. Bro, you didn't know the time. Bro, no. That's, That's why, why so when, I, when I see the assets thing, I was like, wait, wait, what? Like these men, I, f- I heard these men don't even need money. So like, where the money coming from? Who's yeah, paying Yeah, I thought her? their thing was just, if it, bro, it's taxpayers' money. Pays taxpayer money. Bro, I thought she could just pull up to Waitrose and say, yeah, I'm grabbing that. Yeah, she can, but. Bank of England, bro. Let me get some of them, them, them. Them notes with my face. A <laughs> 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 couple, couple boxes for me. Do you know how mad that is? That's mad. A hundred M's. There's got to be more. Yeah, I think there's got to be more, but like stuff has been like police and army and shit like that. Yeah. Like, that's all attacked. No, I'm saying, well, yeah, the thing that, that just goes to directly to her, obviously it's like it was last year. Mate, it was oh, like she must be buzzing when it's payday, 116 boy. or something. She She's going to sleep thinking it's payday tomorrow. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking that's fucking well, mad. under the taxi and she's like, brother. Yeah, <laughs> that's my payday. Nah, do you know how mad? I've got, oh, mate, so many questions, man. Lizzie, boy. She's dank as well. Huh? She was dank as well. Wait, well, when she was yo- when she was young, you saying she was dank? Now, oh, see how you just always got ruined, shit, man. <laughs> Beautiful woman. <sighs> Would you? Don't ask me stupid questions. Yeah, bro. One hundred and sixteen. I was dollar. Sorry, though. One hundred and sixteen. Brother, I had another four billion on top of that. Is probably twenty twenty one, bro. Madness. Mental. But anyway. Uh, I repeat to the queen. Where do you might want to take it next? <laughs> I, I, I was about to say sorry. Obviously, we said all, all, all beautiful things in that. All I'm saying is, like, we do have to face the facts that judgment day is coming, though. You know what I mean? The God judges us all fairly, I say. She got buck Diana at some point. 25, 25 billion ain't saving you, wait. She might have been a good person though. Because I do think how much was she really how many decisions does she really make during like them times? Know who the establishment are, bro. The ones that are telling these lot what to do and what they can't what can't do and shit. You can know, but they have to kill you after. So oh, you make bro. a choice, brother. Bro. Thing is that them growing up, they're like they must be normal people growing when they're growing up. Who? Like the establishment. Yeah. And then they just get into overall overall. Blah, blah, blah. They get into like them seats. Yeah, like they get into the they get in they end up going to the crazy unis and getting into the crazy jobs and it's one of them jobs I reckon that just finds you. You don't find that job. You don't say, Yeah, one day I'm gonna grow up and be nah nah, we'll come yeah. find you. Like, mate, you don't know one person in that thing. I don't I think it'll just be like same thing, like past down and families. You reckon? Like, that's not a bad that's damn too like bad. I'm talking like Rothschilds, you know what I mean? Yeah, them yeah, proper, yeah. like, them ones that have been in conspiracies for the last however many yeah. years about they were all meeting in fucking Denmark in one room and, like, making decisions for the whole yeah. world. No, that, that makes yeah, sense as well. they got to keep it in the same circle. Yeah, that's bro. How, that's how royalty sh- shit like that works, man. That is mad, bro. Queen Elizabeth has died, age 96. Prince Philip was a distant cousin, anyway. Oh, really? You don't know that. No. Wait, weren't she German? She's originally Bro, German. She's, they're like distant cousins. I guess love, love just be finding this. Oh way. yeah, she is German. She's got German in now. I heard yeah. that actually. She's gonna buck Hitler. Mm. Bro, she lived through fifteen prime ministers. My mentor in it. Like she first came in when Churchill was the prime minister. It's like twenty one, twenty five. Bro, she was in. She was queen mm. for as long as my dad's been alive. That's fucking mad. There's something I keep thinking to say. Then one of you man speaks in it. So I <laughs> completely what I'm gonna say. Oh, Elizabeth. That she still don't seem real. Yeah, don't. So I tell you what's sad. The only sad thing I feel. I just feel sad. She's gone. Yeah, and we got this fucker. <laughs> Yeah, like, do you know what I mean? Because we just don't know nothing about him. We just know the bad. So oh, the bad, mate. there's not much good. Mate, didn't they say that he set up Diana? Yeah, there's bear of that. Or oh, like yeah. the, his wife, who was it? The Camilla, there's bear of that. Yeah. Was he with Diana? Yeah, yeah, Charles was with yeah. Diana. She Him? Married. Yes, yeah, yes. Bro. Bro. She married into the family. Yeah, mm. the first, she was the first and one. And then he, apparently he's the one that got her wigged. 
because she was like after it, whatever happened, and she was seeing like a I don't know if he was Middle Eastern or some sort of like foreigner <laughs> she was with, and then wigged. Yeah, she said, "Fuck all this fucking not, lineage." No one shit. knows what happened in that tunnel in Paris, bro. That's fucking weird, bro. You're telling me a member of the royal family can die and no one knows the fucking truth? Oh, they all know. <laughs> we ain't gonna know. They take us for fucking kids. That's what Harry said, isn't it? They ain't gonna stop until they do Megan like they did my mum. <sighs> Damn. Damn. Imagine that shit happening. That's they, you know, right. then, you then, know what I then, think then. it got to a point, yeah? If they didn't speak out about it, like if Harry and Megan just like took it on the chin, took it on the chin. It would have happened. I think the speaking because out was protection. Out, yeah, yeah, I think that was protection. Because then they knew, like, cool. If anything happens now, they know it's them. Yeah. You reckon? 100%. 100% if they would have just stayed quiet and she just got abused, 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 and then one day was wigged, and then, oh, accident, she died, whatever. Um, he left the family for her. Like, it has to be some madness. Or he went on Oprah, you know. And said, yeah, the biggest thing I could go to. Above. Yeah, bruv. 1,000%. Whole shit I've made it. He went to Oprah and then he was living in fucking Thingy's house. Um, what's his name? Not Jordan Peele. Yeah, Jordan Peele's house. Was it Jordan Peele? It was someone. Yeah, Jordan Peele. The one who made like um scary movies. The one who made no, Get no, Out. Get Out. Yeah. yeah. He gave him a mention. He said, "Cool. See, she went to the back community." Yeah, because it wouldn't pay for his security, innit? it? Yeah. The establishment would. They said, the "Oh yeah, yeah." I'm, I actually remember that. So yeah, brother. I remember that. Do you know what I was gonna say? It's not yeah. really like a question or anything. What me and you was talking about, so I'm like, everything's gotta change. Money gotta oh, yeah. change, the stamps gotta change. I see some things saying else. the Queen's death is gonna cost the economy one billion. <laughs> because <laughs> the bank holiday w- that we're gonna have, apparently the stock market's gonna have to close twice for the bank holiday and the day of her funeral. Is there gonna or- be a bank holiday? Yeah. Yeah, there will be, I think. All the money that's gonna all the money that's gotta change. Nah, if you actually think the about it, her fam. dying is actually so mad. Because she's honestly like Yeah. When you think about powerhouses in the in, in the world, you think England. Yeah. yeah. She's actually like gone, bro. We'll never be looked at the same again. Yeah. Like ge- genuinely for the next at least ten years. Forever, yeah. I think. Nah, not forever. But fam. for fucking we need another her. Yeah. So someone to do it for another no, 60 no, years. No, ago. not even that. So we need like another fucking war where we come out on top, but like when yeah, I talk, yeah. like, like that, bro. War. Like, no, I'm I'm being serious because what can you do? Whoever takes that title, what can they really do? Yeah, Just yeah, stay yeah. in power. Okay, yeah. cool. You stay in power. You stay alive. Like they got to do you know something significant. Something yeah. significant's got to happen. We're gonna be coming out of like a super bad time where it's like, oh my god, she fucking restored the country, mm. and you know what I'm saying? Like, she came at the right at like a pivotal point in like the fucking history of. Britain. I just feel like for, for Britain wise, there's there's not much you you can help. Mm. We're so far ahead of everyone. What do you mean, sorry? Oh shit. Well, healthcare, oh, economy. We're we're better than well, I would say better than ninety eight percent of the world. There's not much like you can boost England even more than it is now. Do you, do you see what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and that's why I think like. No one's gonna hold that much clout yeah. ever. Cause Do you reckon? Yeah, people looked at England and thought, "Nah, like we can't even, we can't even try something with them because of the Queen." But now, ugh, my man's in charge. These man can get touched. I was thinking that last, like last two days, bro. Bro, run, I don't. Bro, I was like, I only don't think so because I think people looked at England like Ooh, they got America. Yeah, you know what I'm saying she held so much clout, man. Yeah. The Raheem says she had tourist attraction, man. Like, <laughs> 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 no, I, I do oh agree that people God. respected respected her. Yeah, innit? big time, bruv. Um, damn, you man making me like her more than I thought. I did. God, nah, she it. liked her. It's mad, isn't it? None of us knew. It. I, I guess it makes me kind of understand why people are crying and shit because I don't know her. And like as we talk about, yeah. I'm like, she looks solid, isn't it? Like she like she just held it down. Nah, if you cried, you're all waste, man. Um, yeah, 100%. But I've seen people cry. I was like, if fam, like, I just can't. If you're under 50 understand. and cry, yeah. you're a waste, man. If you're 50 or 60, yeah, yeah, you, she is your, she, she was a major part of, not a major part, part of your whole life. But if you're 20 and crying, you're uh, fucking unique. 
Um, oh my days, bro! <laughs> Did you man see that video? I think Amir sent it again. He was just sending my videos yesterday of um when they stopped their like the girl to be like, oh, you sad? Like the queen's died, and she was like, um, I mean, I'm sad someone's died, but like, I'm not really a big fan of the queen and um the establishment, whatever. Not yeah, the establishment, the royals, that. whatever. And then the guy's like, oh, like, but why? He obviously thought, ah, oh, like, get the fucking next person next to me, you're gonna be sad, and she's like. Well, when you just start thinking of um the British Empire and what oh. they did to me, like she started just finding short in it. The guy was like, "Oh, okay, David, <laughs> <laughs> you got to the wrong one." <laughs> and you know what's good? She was a white girl too, so you kind of been trying fucking uh, uh, say that victim shit. You picked the wrong one. Picked the wrong. You picked the wrong uni student, bro. Travis Sinclair. Yeah, um, I yeah, see what, that what? today on Twitter. Apparently, like I see the talk sport tweets. Yeah, Travis. That we don't support anything. Or- Trevor Sinclair, he's been suspended from the show. I said, yeah. racism was outlawed in England in the 60s. Oh, I see that. And it's been allowed to thrive, so why should black and brown mourn? Hashtag queen. He tweeted that. I'm sorry, that just seemed a perfect time. Man. Speak your shit, young king. <laughs> that was um, that's two years of my life wasted, <laughs> just like that. <laughs> um, and no, yeah, I'm his thing just that. got he just been slewed. He, I think he deleted Twitter, he deleted his tweets. Was it a tweet? Um. I don't think it was that bad. He said racism was outlawed oh. in England in the 60s and it's been allowed to thrive. So why should black and brown mourn? Hashtag queen. I mean, it's just been childish. It, it was just <laughs> wrong time. But what he's saying stands like, because it's like, because I get why there was a feeling that like you were being forced to mourn. You know what I'm mm. saying? Yesterday. So like he's obviously saying like why like why should we like it wasn't fucking perfect for us here yeah. but obviously you don't fucking tweet that the day of the death like yeah yeah do you yeah. think you shouldn't or are stupid to because I think they're two different things stupid to yeah stupid to mourn no do you think his tweet he shouldn't have tweeted it at the time he did yeah. or it was just stupid to do you know what I mean like he shouldn't have tweeted it at all or he's just stupid when he tweeted I think it. just stupid too because I know I like that shit too. Yeah, that's stupid. Man. Yeah, no, that's stupid. It's not like the cream was. I don't think the cream was racist. Other other family members might have been, but and and also like another thing that I was thinking, he's been t- like people are saying he's got to be taken off Talksport now. Like they can't keep him on. He's been yeah. suspended no, he's while be they're doing an investigation. Mm. And it brought me onto the bigger picture. The in my head, what I think is the bigger picture. Someone tweeted like under his tweets, like we live in a world or we live in a country where we have freedom of speech, but we can't say anything. I've been saying this shit, man. My brother tweeted something about that. Yeah, I see your brother saying as well. Yeah, bro, like, I do not think he should be removed from his job because he tweeted that. Like, if you really break it down, he said something like, yeah, the public doesn't like, but didn't say anything like... Uh Uh-huh, she's dead. Think of the, yeah, think of any fucking bad connotation. He didn't say anything. Like of that, mm. maybe you could say it's distasteful, but yeah. it wasn't discriminate. It wasn't like nothing you can actually say. Yo, this is this. Like the timing is so. Yeah, bad it's this. Though. It's the timing, but like. But the timing has caused that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But like, if you said cool, like obviously you're not gonna take anyone to court with a fucking tweet. But like, even like a fucking disciplinary because it's work. What the fuck are they gonna say? You know what I mean? Like, if you actually take it into terms of like, I don't know if you man. I know what you mean. Went to get a discipline yeah, like because you did something reason? against, yeah, re- yeah. you know what I'm saying, the Policies, rules of work. Yeah. What the fuck are they going to say? Yeah. There's nothing you can genuinely, you bought, you bought that doesn't the, go under anything. You brought the company into disrepute. That's guess, what they'll yeah, say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess that's what they can say. But yeah, like, you know what I mean? Come out and said his views are not of TalkSport. Yeah, they, TalkSport replied to his tweet. Yeah. Like TalkSport <laughs> Twitter replied to his tweet saying like, these are the views of Trevor not of TalkSport, we can't get hold of him at this time, but like we're holding an investigation or something. Is it Simon Jordan that owns that? I don't know who owns it. He's, I know he's a big part of it, though. That's I don't know who owns it. owns it. Nah, that's just stupid. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's stupid, it's stupid of him. At least wait a week, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Him, yeah. He would have no effect in a week's time. Yeah, it's, like just it's just the timing. It's just the timing. Yeah. But to say 
he's that's just common sense, man. Anyway, thank you for joining us. R.I.P. to the Queen. R.I.P. Lizzie. Uh, yes, B. Uh, and Charles. Is it Charles? Yeah. Welcome. Yeah. We'll oh, see you in the next one. Babe. Peace.